Now it's time to jump ball. Get it, get it. We're rolling highlights from high school basketball up next. Houston County veterans on the road in the KTL. Third quarter action. Veterans Hoko girls with a tie ball game. Not anymore. Ansley Miranda splashes the three from the top of the key. Nothing but the bottom of the net. Then veterans. Zykeria Jenkins with the rock dishes to Tamia Lucky. And she has a bucket high off the glass to extend the lead. And it's all red, white, and blue in the third quarter. Off the steal, Jenkins starts the fast break. Whoop! And in transition, executes the nice bounce pass to Lucky, who is rewarded for running the floor. Two of her game high 21. And the Lady Warhawks start pulling away. Coco keeps things relatively close. TJ Lawrence, she had 18, but she turns the ball over here in traffic. Jordan Johnson recovers and sinks the floater in the paint. And in the fourth quarter, Hoko shrinks the lead back to single digits. Danielle Childs makes it half a dozen with the money ball, but Veterans holds them off to win 57-47. 56-47 is your final. Stacey Jones also had a big night for Veterans with 19 points in the win. Fellas up next, bring them out, bring them out, bring them out. Unbeaten Veterans hosting Hoko, and the Bears would drop the bomb early. Charles Brown from downtown starts things off with a trifecta, three of his nine points on the night. Veterans would answer back with the layup from TJ Grant going lefty right there. But then Hoko would go on a run. Check out the handles here from Junior HB Morgan. And he's not gone. He's gone, gone to the rim. Gets the bounce off the Euro step and finished with eight points. Continuing series, his brother TJ, he's a senior. Press, press, press with the defense. Pokes the ball loose, causing the steal. And then finishes on the other end with the layup. The senior had 12 points and four steals. The Bears' front court is definitely a problem. More Hoko on offense. Derek Cotton to Kobe Nelson off the glass. It is a 13-2 run in the first, but veterans turn things around, make it, makes it a closer game. Omari Joseph gets the turnover, feeds TJ Grant, who shakes the rim with a two-fisted jam. Veterans remains unbeaten. They take down the Bears 50-47. Up here in Macon, Central coach Andre Taylor looking mighty sharp on game night hosting Peach County. Xavier Gibson dishes to Antonio Carr. Ball going up on a Tuesday. You can give them all three of those. Chargers lead by nine. Next play, nice ball movement by the Chargers. Carr finishes with a two-handed flush. And the Chargers are on top big time. Then Mama, there goes that man again. Antonio Carr with a pick and goes coach to coach with the rim. Araka. Chargers lead by 13. The Trojans do close the gap, though. Ja'Cory Brooks passes to Elijah Stern. And he seeks the floater. And the Trojans cut the deficit to four, middle of the second quarter. But too much Chargers Quay. Primus with the shot, card with the rebound, and the hoop in the harm. The big man had a double double of 22 points and 21 boards. Central gets the 73 62 win.